I will be trading whatever I get from this box all the way up to the mythical Kitsune crew. So let's unbox it. Oh, we got a falcon fruit. And on this falcon fruit, there's a code that we can scratch off. There's the code. And if we redeem this code, we get a fruit box. And whatever I get from this fruit box will be what I will start the trading with. So please be something good, please be something good, please be something good. Oh, it's a light fruit. That's actually a really good fruit to begin with. Well then, let's search a trade for this. All right, for the first trade, I found this guy with a magma fruit, trading for my light fruit. So of course, I did the trade, and now we have the magma fruit. And right after that, I did this trade for a quake fruit, which I hope was a W because that magma fruit was all I had. And I think that trade was a W because I found this guy who was trading me their Buddha fruit for my quake fruit. 10, nine, oh, oh, never mind. Oh, love fruit. Okay, he's trading the love fruit. I mean, that's good enough. I mean, of course we didn't get, get the Buddha because that was way too good, but at least we get the love fruit, which, is pretty decent and definitely better than quake we have the love fruit and i gotta say this fruit is looking lovely but you know what else looks lovely the subscribe button so please hit the subscribe button we're trying to hit 1 million anyways let's look for the next trade all right here love <gasps> kitsune no way it's right before my eyes too no i have nothing to trade him oh of course he hopped off of course he's not gonna take a love fruit for a whole kitsune fruit which is worth eight million and is the rarest fruit in the game of course he's not gonna take only love for that you know what we have to get better fruits to get that kitsune fruit now that i've seen it i i'm even more motivated to get it let's go and the fire in my heart came in clutch because right after that i found this trade for a phoenix fruit oh my god love for phoenix who does that well there we go we now have the phoenix fruit oh man all right let's keep going all right phoenix this man is offering rocket whitebeard is not cooking with this trade okay okay let's accept this what, what the hell it's not only we accept well uh, that's another fail right here phoenix please something good pain okay oh oh gravity uh i mean i don't have anything else oh whatever man yeah the heart in my fire was pretty short-lived but i didn't stop there i kept on looking and eventually found this trade for a spider and love fruit yeah we're accepting that let's go sick that trade was good all right let's keep going and then the next trade that i found even shocked me all right amasu Let's see what you got. Spider and love. Buddha. Okay, okay, okay. And light. That's a big W. Hold on, hold on, hold on. Let's go. Five, four, three, two, one. Let's go. Have fun. I have a spare Buddha. Oh, this man just wanted to trade his uh, Buddha away because he spun another. What a kind man. That, that actually works very well with us. And I'm confident that this Buddha fruit will carry us to our next mythical fruit. After a while, I found this trade for a magma fruit again. This actually reminds me of the trade that we did in the very start. Oh man, we have gone so far so quick. And now we have the magma fruit again. Alright, sick. And then after that, I found probably the most shocking trade. Buddha? This is our second Buddha. Hold on, hold on, hold on. There's no way, there's, there's no way this trade goes through. There is no way. Four, three, two one oh my god that trade went through and now we have two buddha fruits i just traded a magma to a buddha but now the only problem i see we don't have anything more to trade along with the buddha fruit because most of the time whenever we trade like a buddha fruit to something big the 40 percent difference always gets in the way because the buddha fruit value is so low so i decided to unbox another plushie so this is the mini plushie uh, I already opened the big one, so let's let's put this aside. It looks adorable compared to the big one. So, let's open it. Ooh, we got a rubber fruit. Okay. But most importantly, we got another code from that. And let's scratch this off. And let's redeem it. Wait, what if I get, like, the kitsune fruit from this? Wait, that, that would actually be insane. Anyways, let's open this. Ooh, and we got a light fruit. Now, I was actually expecting something better, but this is pretty decent too. And with that, this is how our inventory looks. And I'm not gonna lie, I think we can easily get some good traits with this. Like two Buddhas and a light? Definitely we can get something good for this. And I was right. We did get something really good. Yo, you're welcome. He's already he's already saying welcome. What the hell? Alright, three, two, one. And we got the dough fruit. And now we have one dough and one Buddha. Let's just search for the next trade already. All right, here, dough. 
Shadow? Rumble? Nah. That's, that's pretty bad. All right, after searching for a while, I found this guy who was trading me a dragon fruit for a Buddha fruit. Oh, wait. Hold on. Wait, I have nothing to add. Wait, I need to unbox another plushie. Hold on, hold on, hold on. Before that guy leaves. Quick. Uh, all right, there we go. There we go. We got the ice fruit. We got the ice fruit. All right, let's grab this off quick. All right, let's redeem this quick. Hopefully, this guy doesn't leave. Unbox the fruit box. And we got a blizzard fruit. Oh, man, that's actually too much. I'll, 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 I think I'll have to ask him to add something. All right, here we go. Please, please add something. Rumble? There, he doesn't need to add rumble. I just needed one extra fruit to trade along with the other fruits. Bro, I'm literally ripping this guy off right now. Four, three, two, one. And we have gotten another massive W trade. How am I getting so lucky with everything? I guess he I guess he just needed the Buddha fruit. I'll, I'll look at him. He, he's swearing. He's swearing all over the place. No problem, man. Enjoy the Buddha. <laughs> Enjoy getting ripped off. Ha ha ha. You too, man. Th thank you very much. Is he going to keep thanking me? Wait, is, is he leaving or is he just going to keep thanking me? See ya, man. All right. All right. Thanks again. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah. This is a never ending thanks. Oh, oh, there he goes. All right. Well, with that, we have now gotten the dragon fruit. We are so up. We have the dragon, the dough, and also the rumble. Like we basically got this rumble fruit for free. He didn't even have to add rumble. I don't know why he did that. Bro, I swear this isn't scripted. This guy just added rumble for no reason. What the hell? All right, here, rumble. What are you going to offer? What are you going to offer? Come on. Sound and Phoenix. Okay. I think that's a pretty good trade, actually. All right, let's accept this. 3.5 million value for 2.1 million value. And also sound has pretty good demand. And with that, we now have two more fruits to work with. So now let's try to upgrade these two fruits to something better than a rumble fruit. And after searching for a bit, I found a really good upgrade for my fruits. Shadow. Barrier. Uh, can he... Okay, okay, what about, what about magma? That's like a small upgrade. Hold on. Can you do magma? Can you do magma? Oh, he added magma. Let's go. And with that, we now have the shatter fruit and also a magma fruit. Look, I'm going to tell you a pro tip. You have to negotiate for anything, no matter if it's a dealing in real life or dealing in block fruits. You could get something better with negotiating. So always negotiate. And after searching for a while, I found a really big W of a trade. Oh, dough, dough. Okay, okay. I'm gonna push my luck here. Oh man, he accepted it. Nah, he hopped off at the very last second. Well, whatever, that sucks. But I didn't let that stop me because I found another trade, but this time it was for my magma food. All right, it's magma for spider. Let's go. Hey, with that, we now have the spider fruit. Oh, man, we're, we're doing some good trades here. And after that trade, I found this guy who was trading me their mammoth fruit. Okay, I don't know. I don't know if this is a good trade, but I can't even add spider. He already has spider. Maybe let's just put let's just push out a look. Maybe, maybe he accepts this. Maybe he accepts this. Uh oh, he hopped off. Well, come, come on, spider. Oh, is he, is he not going to add? I am not doing that. And then I found another guy. And this time, the stakes were high. He was trading a venom and also a Buddha fruit. Oh, wait, 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 wait. We need to secure this trade. We need to secure this. I hope that's enough. Because if I add anything else, this trade will instantly become my L trade. I'm really, I'm, I'm just praying. Oh, oh. He didn't even let me accept. Well, whatever, I guess. And things were looking pretty hopeless as I struggled to find another trade. But right when I started losing hope, I found this trade. Okay, control. Okay. Uh, okay, how about shadow and spider? All right, please. I hope he accepts. I hope he accepts. Let's go. He accepted. All right. Very nice. Another W trade. And now we have the control fruit. Now the control fruit is good because it's getting a rework very soon and the hype is up for it, which should hopefully mean that the control fruit demand is higher. All right. I found this man right here. True check. You know what? I'll, I'll just add, I'll just add dough and dragon. See, see what he wants. Oh hell spider. No, that's not a good start. That is not a good start. What the hell? He just said on God and added quake, ghost and rubber. What the hell? He's floating. What the hell? This guy has given me like the worst offer. Is that heaven? Did the heavens like choose? Oh, oh, never mind. He fell off. And while I was searching, I found another person with the Kitsune fruit. Oh my God. Kitsune, Kitsune, Kitsune. Wait, 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 wait. Wait, this time is different. I have just enough fruits. Hopefully, maybe. Please accept. Please. Oh, he, oh, he's thinking about it. He's thinking about it. Hmm. Yeah, come on, come on, come on, come on. Please, please, please. Oh, oh. 
Nah, your offer is way off. What? Well, what do they even want for the Kitsune fruit? Well, I guess we have to get even better fruits. And just by seeing that Kitsune fruit again, I had a new fire in my heart and went for this crazy trade that I found again. Hey, let's go. We now have the spirit fruit. And this is what our inventory looks like now. We're getting there. We're getting there. We almost are there to the Kitsune fruit. Just a little bit more, just a little bit more of trading and then we'll get it. And with that new motivation, I kept finding better and better trades. Ooh, dragon. Oh, hell yeah. We are up. We now have gotten the dragon fruit from just the dough fruit. And with that, our inventory now looks like this. Two dragons and one spirit. And right after that, I found another crazy trade. I live on Ohio. Here you go, spirit. What can you offer? I live on Ohio. Sound. Buddha. And light. You know what? We might just do this. I know this may seem like a L, but trust me, we need this Buddha fruit. I am confident that I can get this Buddha fruit to another mythical fruit. And with that, we now have the sound fruit, a Buddha fruit, and also a light fruit. Pretty good downgrade for the spirit fruit. But you know what? I am confident that we can find a better trade with this. And then I started searching for trades. And the best trade I found was for a falcon, bomb, and dark. Maybe, maybe I'm, maybe I'm just getting unlucky. This guy, this guy just removed all the fruits that he was offering. And then after much searching, the best trade I found at that time was for this magma fruit. Ooh, light for magma. Pretty, pretty good trade. And now we upgraded our light fruit to a magma fruit. And then right after that, I upgraded my magma fruit to a love fruit. Ooh, there we go. We now have the love fruit. And with that, I am sure now we can find better trades with this. So let's search. Mammoth, okay. Uh, maybe let's try, let's try sound and love maybe oh never mind all right rumble spirit venom okay um i could do sound oh, oh he removed everything maybe sound no oh, never mind he opted off oh sound double mammoth and another sound and and a buddha okay uh, i have nothing to add i can't even add the dragon fruit well whatever i guess venom spirit doe and mammoth i think i might accept that oh oh he removed everything. What the hell? Now he's he wants to trade mammoth and control. That could have been a big trade. He just he just decided to remove everything. After a lot of searching and a lot of struggle and a lot of failed trades, the best trade that I found was for the spider fruit. Okay, love for spider. Uh, I mean that's that's a very small upgrade, but it's still something. Pretty small W, but it's something. And right after that, I found this trade for a doe fruit. Ooh, doe fruit. Okay, hold on, hold on. Hold on. All right, let me do sound plus Buddha. All right, let's see. Let's go. All right, three, two, one. We now have the doe fruit. Very nice. And I think it's about time we should try searching for a leopard fruit trade. But I think I'll upgrade my fruits a little bit more to, to possibly find this leopard fruit trade. Like, what the hell? Permanent bomb. I mean, I have nothing to offer and this guy has everything that I have. Come on, please. Pre-permanent bomb, please. Oh, he hopped off. Within just a little bit of searching, I found this trade for not only a leopard fruit, but also a Buddha fruit. Oh man. We now have the leopard fruit and now we are actually really, really close to the mighty Kitsune fruit. But we still have to get a few more things to get that Kitsune fruit trade. After that, I found this trade for a dragon and venom fruit. Ooh, dragon and venom. Hold on, hold on. That's pretty good actually. Doe and Buddha. Okay, come on. Come on. And accept. Let's go. This trade is quite a deal actually. Doe got upgraded to dragon and Buddha got upgraded to venom. All right here, spider and venom. Oh, he, oh, okay. Doe, all right. Pretty nice. And now with that, we now have the doe fruit. Bro, these trades are so crazy. I've been so lucky this entire video. And now let's search for a Kitsune fruit trade. I am sure this is more than enough. I searched a lot. Like really, a lot. I searched like crazy and I couldn't find any Kitsune fruit trades, like none. Because the people with Kitsune were very low. And the people who did have Kitsune, they wanted something permanent for it. And yeah, I don't have any permanent fruits. But looks like we'll have to unbox another plushie. We need one more fruit box. So, well, let's just do it. All right, let's open this very gently because this is our final fruit box. All right, let's go. Let's go. Oh, yeah. Ooh, wait, wait, is that a light fruit? Wait, that's a light fruit. Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Wait, I tossed it, my bad. Oh, 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 crap. Oh, 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 
I keep, I keep dropping it. All right, there's the light fruit. There is the light fruit. <laughs> Look at how cute it looks. That's so cool. Look at how squishy it is too. Like it, it doesn't care. Wait, we also got our super food box code. Hold on. And we also have another food box, like a physical food box and a permanent food box. Let's scratch this very gently. All right, there's the code for the permanent food box. Okay. And there's the physical one. All right, let's redeem this quick. All right, first off, we're going to redeem the physical food box. Let's unbox it, please. And we got a rocket fruit. Oh, man, that, that sucks. No problem, though, because we still have a permanent fruit box. Okay, hopefully it doesn't give me, like, a permanent rocket or something. Like, please, like, give me anything, like, somewhat useful. All right, there you go. That's the code. And there's the super fruit box. Let's unbox it. It has to be something good. It has to be something good. And a permanent ice fruit. Oh, man, that's not bad. That could actually. Now we have the leopard, dragon, doe, a rocket if you want to count that. And also permanent ice. I was hoping to get something better, but ah, it's 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 okay. I think permanent ice might just work too. And yes, it did. Because I finally found our final trade. Our very final trade. Alright. Da Lemure. There's the kitsune fruit. There it is. The mythical kitsune fruit. Eight million value and we are trading a leopard dragon doe and also a permanent ice this is like crazy overpay for a kitsune fruit the journey is finally over with this trade let's accept 10 9 8 7 6 5 4 3 2 and one now we have the kitsune fruit oh man that was the most stressful trading i have done but also the luckiest trading i've done and with that we finally have the kitsune fruit and we also have the rocket fruit uh, which uh which i'm actually gonna eat all right there we go we have ate the rocket fruit with that we finally have the kitsune fruit this kitsune fruit actually looks way better when you spend like hundreds of hours trying to get this Anyways, if you want to see my other trading videos, then click here and subscribe to get infinite W trades. We are trying to reach 1 million and bye.